Hello, good day to you. This is KV Fabian speaking to you from the Rose Studio and I'm presenting to you another real quick inventory. The date is February 2nd, 2021. What I'm going to be doing is going through my uh, the things I've printed out, my prints, to uh, put them in horizontal and vertical since uh, most of them, the line shirt, are not signed like they're signed here. Um, I'll wait. I'll, I'm just going to do it now because I have to. If I get it in, in the proper proper uh, from turning them the right way instead of upside down, it'll be faster to do uh, do my signing. I'm signing in no way. Am I saying that I I, I did these? It's just saying that I've, they're in my collection, and uh, I'm I've uh, printed them out at this point uh, to make them easily accessible at. Uh, by eight and a half by eleven. So I was uh, actually uh, one of the things I'm very interested in is the question of uh, personal beauty, and uh, I have a blog that actually is, deals with the subject by looking at uh, short subject videos, mostly musical, from from anime. The, the anime genre is actually. Uh, from Japan, I believe, uh, which is animated films that deal with studies of beauty, and uh, also popular music that happens to come to my box of all different kinds. And if I if I find that the uh, that the uh, subject to me hits something to do with appealing beauty, I will put it in my blog, which is treasuregallery.blogspot.ca. Mostly they're musical videos uh, under four minutes five minutes maybe maximum five minutes is long and there's all sorts of studies that I feel are, are somehow worthy of note and beauty at the same time uh, I had the uh, had quite an adventure in contact and, and got in touch with uh, someone who was someone's muse who was reaching the tender age of 60 years old and uh, at that time she uh, she happened to have the uh, the, the opportunity to have a huge huge body and face makeover everything done and she looked absolutely superb and uh, she felt it was the time for her to, to uh, see if she could do something uh, to work with with one of the things the phenomena that they have uh, on the websites and the internet is the fact that the extremely powerful feelings that that, that are evoked uh, in, in simple people by, by, by pictures of beautiful superb men and women and uh, at the time uh, sh they were looking for someone to to work with uh, blessing the crops by taking the, the very strong feelings that they have they've had all sorts of extremely important uh, uh, no relatively humble people just going fearlessly into fights over over exceptionally beautiful images in, in the fantasy world of, uh, of, uh, of, of photography and uh, this is a phenomenon that has happened so much so that some people believe that there's a magical power in beautiful images in themselves and so forth Th therefore often people who are taken who, who this, somehow someone has been impressed by this particular image uh, this woman has been uh, sometimes it's a lot up, up to a certain point it's a lot of time by mistake people don't expect it that much I mean they expect it as a general general rule of thumb but there hasn't been too much or there hadn't been too much thought in this particular in a particular community of, of looking for a special person to 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 consciously have those pictures made uh, of of these fantasy creatures uh, of her and use it to to uh, to evoke the, the powerful feelings on purpose so that they could know the person she has a good lineage and bless the crops so i had uh, the uh, the 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 pleasure and, and the the honor to 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 touch bases with this woman of which i i actually uh, started uh, she was looking actually what she was very much interested in was honey and so I, 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 at the time, which is gone now, I started a board uh, of images that I found had to deal with some of the things she felt important, including the worker and honey and bees and scarecrows and all sorts of stuff dealing with the crop. 
which uh, I remember she came dressed in and really beautiful worker clothes. So she looked like a modern day combination of Bohemian musician and uh, Fritz Lang's Metropolis, the, go the, go the worker goddess there with the long blonde hair. And uh, uh, Flash, as it was, nothing ever happened from that board she was going to contact. She just, she never really got back to the board and I never heard anything about it. And as, you know, nothing happened from it. And I, I, the, the images that I had gathered are long gone. But I, I never stopped working on, uh, on my treasure gallery, which is at treasuregallery.blogspot.ca. And uh, I got contacted by her very briefly, recently. And uh, <clears throat> what did I do? I started thinking about the idea again of, uh, of what happens if somebody just spontaneously gets gets put in a position of uh, of being being exceptional made beautiful for some reason or other as happened to me and i started to think about what happens and i had written the song i had composed it in the white house actually uh, com with it's called uh what, what what's the song called What are you waiting for? What are you waiting for? Love me like you do. And uh, <clears throat> at the time I was thinking to myself, despite all the power that, that some of these, these, these images and, and the potency that some of the women seem to, to have to, to different people who don't know them at all, um, sometimes the feelings that you get when you're put in such a position are very mundane and very simple like that. Like that song, Love Me Like You Did, it has nothing to do with position, has nothing to do with power. It has to do actually with something that happens even with assault sometimes, though I think it's overrated and much abused, is that sometimes you're flattered by all this attention that is lavished on you as a simple woman. And Love Me Like You Do was, was, was actually written about that, which uh, at the time there were, you know, not that good relationships between the United States and, and Canada. And I, I, I feel the song neatly sums up that sometimes it's just not a question of, of thinking of anything, of just of, just of, of the, the sensual gratification, gratification of, and the excitement of, and, and the beauty of being made beautiful if you're just, you know, like you're every day and you're not or extraordinary when you're just every day. And, uh, so I think what she had done at 60 years old was uh, was actually right on. And uh, yet I, it's funny because as I, I reflect on it, I realize you have both, you know, <laughs> you have people who do it on purpose and you just have this fly by night, relatively simple person who, who gets put in a situation where they're made uh, very pretty or, or lovely or exceptional, like they have an orchestra or, or, or something going with them. And they're just in this huge ball gown, like love me like you do. And uh, the house does have feelings, which I wrote in that song, which I, I tried, that, that people would be rather surprised about, even yourself. So these are my images. As you see, I still am very much interested in beauty. They'll be signed and dated so that I know where they know, uh, so that it could be identified that they're part of my collection. In no way did I make them. I keep even the writing and everything of them. And uh, they, they're, uh, they're now uh, the right size for me to put them away, which I have, uh, have problems protecting and preserving my, my collection, as such as you, the things you see here. Um, if you have any information on or, or, or help or to offer on how I can preserve my estate, uh, right now the shekels, the bucks are very scarce. But I could use some support on preserving, protecting, and even maybe getting paid for the work I've done. There's also a question of a missing 7,000, a whopping 7,000 photographs that were actually disappeared during the holiday season. So if you have any information or, or, or help or ways I could figure out uh, what to do, for example, let me give you an example. Even if I would find a firm that would be able to get me my 7,000 plus docs in their prop, with their proper names and their proper folders, I don't even know where to start my search to look for an agency that would do it. So even that would be good and prices would be great. 